I, I like to, to take on things I've never tried before. So I think, I don't know where it had happened, but the first time I was asked to do was a special project, some, uh, when was it, site-specific, uh, Van Abbey Museum, on a retrospective there in, in the 70s. I, I did a, a, a site-specific piece for one of their rooms. Um, and then any time there's been an opportunity to do that, I've, I've done that. Well, I, I think the first one was I was I was I was going to bisect it uh, vertically, uh, and, and and again I'm working seeing it as a photograph. It's in the, what I do, you know, so half of it was the way it's supposed to be. The other half I just turned upside down, but the upside down part was just going to be a backdrop and like a movie set, uh, and it's going to be painted, um, and 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 then it worked perfectly with. Uh, uh, Italia, we, uh, part, half of Italia was turned upside down, and it became a great composition. And the uh, the, pro, the uh, backdrop would have been in black and white, and then the other part would be colors. When the other one, I was just going in top, just to have a, a big black rectangle, the same, no more boring art. And then Daniel thought it might be taken as a critique. Some of the artists might have been sensitive. Uh, I, I think my modus here was um, on the third trial. Just to do something that nobody could argue with, you know, give, you know, and usually people do argue when you do it that way. I've learned in the past, but, but and just to see it as a flat, a flat picture plane, and I approached it kind of like I did a Mies van der Rohe houses. You know, I, I studied his houses, you know, by photographs, and so I began to see the facade just as a photograph that I would work with. Then it makes it a lot easier because that's what I do, uh, and. Uh, so I decided I'd look at it just like a picture postcard, a tourist card. When I saw La Biennale, I thought right away, okay, you just said welcome to or greetings from, you got it. <laughs> uh, and uh, and you know, I just used elements from uh, Crayfield, the palm tree, the ocean. Uh, and I wanted to, you know, it works out architecturally very well, just sky divided up vertically that way, pretty easy. Flanking either side by two more columns of palm trees. You got it, right? So it looks like a Roman villa, uh, you know, on the, uh, in this case, on the in Pacific, you know, so it looks like a full Roman villa in, in, in Malibu, kind of, you know, but, it, but it's, it'd be located here in the Giardini. But so there's all kind of convoluted times and styles involved. I think, um, for me, simplicity is uh, paradoxically complex also, but it looks simple. <laughs>